Chapter 7, The Statue of Quitting, in the audiobook, The Quitter's, Quitter's Guide. Like, being a statue some days, it's like cut clarity, um, color. These are all characteristics of a statue that somewhere in there, you just had to sit still. Had to be completely frozen. Like, kind of like the Tournament of Power, the guy that could freeze time and freeze people. You just gotta freeze your times. Um, yeah. There are all type ways to freeze yourself into a statue. Be a statue of marble, a marvel. Um, diamonds, concrete stone, pearl, gems. All these facets allow you to just sit still. And the whole point is to sit still till you get bored enough to fall back to sleep. Especially if you ain't got nothing to do for the day. Um, being a statue some days... It made sense because the more you sit still, the more you can hear like Tom just cry out that, hey, I wanted to live. I wanted to do something with my life. I wanted to evolve into like this characteristic of a very powerful being, but that will grew to be a statue. It kind of balances itself out like the Libra scale could be considered a statue like figure. But there are all types of statues throughout the years that grew monumentally into like the complete ultimate being of like a force field that was like an anti-crisis situation. Um, somewhere in there, I knew that the characteristics of like concrete and rock. They covered most of the land's landscape. So if you going to be on land, why not embrace that face set? Um, <clears throat> of course, you got things like the Statue of Liberty. But I guess... <coughs> <coughs> the whole point is 